Hey XQC, when will your merch be available again? I wasn't able to buy one when they came out and now they are sold out, will you make more XQCL merch or will that never come back? Also chat, any wide people happies? Um, it's the same as always okay, dude. PVC, I love you XQCL, just kidding, SHSHSHS. Merch probably doesn't come back, but maybe uh, if people really like certain concepts, they come back. So I see some people in chat saying, uh, ha ha ha, merch is bully magnet, and then they DM me at people night and like, oh dude, like, is it gonna come back? People so I just blocked them mom jokes. and I banned them. People clap more mom jokes. 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 People clap. <sighs> okay. Uh, it'll be a good break from DS, I think. What is it? Stop with that. Sorry, 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 sorry. Southeast Asia. What? What is that close to? Hey, so I've done a full body cleanses on both of them. Space is sterile. <sighs> Did you get blood samples for Kensington's research project? Mm-hmm. <sighs> nice work, Doctor Wakefield. So another drone. Yeah, they dropped nerve agent on their apartment block. A woman was coming home from the shops. The boy was playing with a soccer ball. What, you mean a, a football? Good one. Hi. I'm Amy. You're... Dad. Hello. Pleasure to meet you, Dad. Are you going to hurt me? Like a joke, man. I'm Team Doctor. You got injured, but I'll have you back playing football very soon. So these are lip fillers, right? Reese, I need to administer atropine. Yeah, I, I didn't get a chance to restart the vials. Supply tent now! Oh, no. It's okay. Tell him. It's okay. Atropine injections worked on everyone I treated in Syria. Okay? Hey, hey, hey. hey. You're all right. You're all right. What's your name? Dima. We're not safe here. The Supreme Leader ordered this attack. What's wrong with the screen? to help you. He's trying to kill us. Both of us will stand against him. Oh. Tell me. Will this camera go? Ruin my life. Tosa. Yes. It's very serious. You're in the best possible hands, I promise. Honesty. It's very nice to hear it for once. Thank you. See? I need I need to save my baby. Uh -oh. The supply tent's been depleted. There's only one vial left. What are you gonna do? Make a decision. Oh, thanks. Guys, otherwise it's a double kill, man. Dima, give me your arm. <sighs> Dima, please, you have to trust me. This will save you and your baby. Uh. 
pancakes. I know. What? They're not our usual pancakes, if you don't like it, just tell me. Sure. How is that a simp? Reese, how do I save them both? Guys. Reese! It's one kill or double kill? But I guess at the same time, if you really need to make babies, you could just make the guy fuck a bunch of girls and then, then they get, they get in a quad kill. We stand on the precipice of history. I'm Dr. Amy Tennant, and I'm here on behalf of the visionary Natalie Kensington to inform you how your investments have made that possible. Firstly, we've been using your billions for the greater good. The Kensington Corporation's relationship with Kindar has flourished since the resolution of its civil... Honesty, bravery, curiosity, intelligence, sensitivity. War. Our teams have been working on development projects with some of the country's top scientists. Natalie has even developed an internship program for some of the country's brightest young minds. In fact, some of our Kindarian interns are here with us today. Ooh -wee. Is Kindar still a totalitarian state? Human rights violations and all that shit? <gasps> shit. Engage. How come? Kindar is at peace, but your concern is understandable. May I continue my presentation? I'm just saying, it's bad PR for us to associate with Kensington. She's dealing with the dictator. Well, as you've seen, that's simply not the case. Why is there so much research happening out there? It's a fucking waste of our money and resources. Kindar is a former British colony, and we're all here trying to help- Why is it lagging? Seems like good philanthropic PR to me. And it's a tax haven. Good one. Hold up. I'll do um, a game capture instead. Right, it's because of the encoding uh, process. This should be uh, slightly better. Oh no. Now, the real reason you're here. The Kensington Complex. Our impenetrable HQ of laboratories built bespoke to Natalie's specifications by the world-renowned Parker Kaplani. Deep within the complex is Security Lab Alpha, a womb of scientific advancement. There, we have something remarkable in development. I'm sure Sorry. all of your news feeds have told you that Gordon Grosvenor's expedition to Mars is becoming a reality. Yes, the first person to set foot on Mars will be British if we can hurdle this final obstacle together. Fake. Hey. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah, rough night. Don't do drugs, Kay. Good one. We can't fit a hospital on a 10-ton Mars lander. How do we get around this? Nanocells. Stem cells interwoven with nanotech. Once inside a host, they migrate to the site of injury. There, they regrow bone and generate extra blood to help catalyze the healing process. Tiny magic bullets <gasps> of course what's your problem <sighs> this is of course just a mock-up the real nano cells are still in development and securely back at the complex but once they're ready She's filming. we can begin regulated human trials 
Having treated victims of chemical attacks all over the world, I know that nanocells could be miracle tech. <gasps> oh, Jesus! <laughs> some serious concerns about this. Likewise, before my employer invests any more capital, she wants some answers. Amy, I really can't wait. We need to get you to the car now. Let's get the fuck out, dude. It's an emergency. I have to go, but please stay and enjoy the wonderful hospitality. Let's go, Emily. We need to get you on the scene. I just leave? Because they didn't value her presence anyway. What happened? They were being dismissive and annoying you. So it's they can deal with problems, you pussy bitch. I'm ruling out food poisoning. She has other alarming symptoms, we've been told. Naturally, everyone's crying terrorism. A suicide bomber with a malfunctioning bioweapon? We need to get her to the complex. Okay, why is this our problem? Because she's one of our interns. Thank God you're here. This is beyond our remit. Oh. Excellent quarantine work. I'll examine her back at the complex. Yeah, we were waiting on your word before moving her. Uh, a single person drone or ground ambulance. The drone will get her there faster. But it's more dangerous. If it crashes, then whatever's inside her, it gets out into the public. It won't crash. It's Kensington Tech. Use the drone, Amy. The bail I feel. I'll answer the drone. Drone. Don't fuck it up. So, what else do we know about her? Nothing yet. Let's get back to the complex. I like that. Dude. She's sassy, dude. She's hot. Is she not, dude? She has attitude. She has confidence, conviction, dude. And she has you know, those, those lip fillers. <laughs> I like that. God damn. Lip fillers are fine, dude. Don't be weird. Guys, saying you don't like lip fillers is kind of saying that I don't like auto tune because it's not real. You know, you like it because of the way it sounds. In a strange country, I can empathize with that. Today we need all your field experience, Amy. Time to roll back the ears. Mm -hmm. You can say that again. You've got to be kidding me. Nah. It's been a while, Doctor Wakefield. You got here fast. Well, there weren't any blood vomiting ladies on my tube line. Reese Wakefield. Hug. Let's walk and talk. No hug, huh? Easy. So, which legend fed the media the anthrax rumor? I need to take this. Was it her? So, do we have a name yet? Claire Mahek, she's one of us. Inside job. Now, she must be acting alone. Why else would she take the two? Well, Uber doesn't offer a getaway car service yet, so... Look, if we considered the hysteria might actually be valid. Well, terrorism, I highly doubt it. Terrorism? Receptive as ever. Hey, Amy, look, I promise I didn't know you still worked here. If I did, I would have... Stayed away? Yeah, I'm sure. Look. Why are you skydiving? Or bungee jumping, or whatever it is that you were up to? Because I'm passing through London. I checked my Twitter feed this morning, so something I could help with. Plus, Kensington wants my expertise again. Well, she already has my expertise. I'm not disputing that, nor am I apologising for the skydiving. Guy's got to live. <gasps> How could you? And then if you could come back and let me know your decisions. Okay, thank you. Yep, she's hot. Yeah, I told you. You didn't want to run this by me? 
Two lifesavers are better than one. Reese Wakefield is a deserter. I know he's let us down in the past, but people change. Emily did due diligence too. Come on. It's not necessarily for those. Uh, it, they hey, don't really uh, move. Guys, can I just uh, have five minutes? Can just, I uh, just need to use the gents. The deserting is weird, Can we go, please? I want to use up too. Now I'm gonna use the toilet as well. There are toilets down there. Amy! Oh, I don't believe this. What am I simping? I'm the girl, man. Ah! I tapped out Bison. Gender fluid toilets, new policy. <sighs> Cancelled. It's a question mark, dude. He's having a bad time, man. Let him, let him be, dude. He's having a tough time dealing with his feelings, and he Can needs to get the time out. Just to re stabilize, dude. Over. You should see the other guy. Security lab alpha. Nan, is this my tech? Yes. But how? I mean, nothing leaves or enters the lab without us knowing about it. Emily and I will get to the bottom of that. You just get the nanocells, otherwise our life's work's gone. All of the nanocells are inside of her? It, it was the master batch. No duplicates were made. Good luck. She doesn't have fillers. She does, though. They're not, they're not that tough to detect, dude. Woo! Oh my god, you guys are serious about your fashion. Yeah, no more frumpy hazmat suits. Pressure suits? You'll see. Alright. Guys, she 100% does, okay? D guys, don't this on this. The top is flipped, okay? It's completely angled and it doesn't move when she talks, dude. I didn't click. That's okay, that's what I wanted anyway. Better change in facilities than in the Congo, eh? Yeah. And Kinder. Not bad. Oh, that body, what the fuck, man? He has a big belly and no booty. I'm not attracted by men, you know, but... Dude, he has a, he has, he has a big belly and no back juicer. It's flat, dude. Even I have a bigger juicer than We're that. We're going into space. Something like that. Echo! This vacuum acts as the last line of defense to prevent microbes from escaping the lab. The lack of air makes it sterile as hell. Well, that's great on a microscopic level, but it could do with some physical... <laughs> Those physics did. Barriers. How long have you worked here again? Why would I ignore that? Four years last Wednesday. Yeah, it's been that long. Just thinking about some of the stuff we saw. I saw a whole other year's worth after you left. It wasn't just skydiving. I needed a reset. Try new things. Learn anything that could help us today? <laughs> this oh, no. green screen. <laughs>
Ouais. So the meditation's new. So's the spying. Touche. Vacuum condition inactive. Labs run pog. Dr. Thomas Malkin, Dr. Everly North. This is Dr. Reese Wakefield. He'll be assisting us today. Cool pony cell. Let me take you to her. <sighs> Feels like the center of those dolls that go inside each other. Matryoshka dolls. Yeah. Russian, aren't they? <laughs> so what's your story then, Malkin? I've wanted to assist Dr. Tennant since I saw a talk at the plane summit about the extracellular matrix and lattice in stem cells. Yeah. Cool, man. Holy shit. It's attacking the bone structure. We've never seen anything like it. I have a sample of her blood under the microscope. Let's go take a look, then. The nanocells are inside her. But they're unfinished. There's no off switch, so they're just coursing through her body, producing excess bone and blood. But how could she have contracted them? From a spillage, maybe. They barely survive for two minutes once they're exposed to air, and she didn't have the authorization to access them. Someone's put them in her. No, 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 no. leave it in, Claire. You need it. Feels fucking weird. <laughs> You're a terrorist. It'd be a terrible one if I was. I did this for Nina. What a great what question. Nina? Then. Terrorist organization. Oh, you stop that, please. Look, how many times have we seen a lone wolf release pathogens into the air? Nanocells aren't airborne. They can only be transferred via blood to blood contact. Answer call. Named as Claire Mahek, a Kendarian intern at Kensington. TV off. Terrorist. Tell me you can retrieve our nanocells. Not directly. We'd need to extract a large blood sample to keep them active. From there, I'll use that as a roadmap to recreate the master batch. Seems simple enough. She has plenty of blood to spare. Not exactly. Her new bone matter is consuming her body's resources at an accelerated rate. If I remove that much blood in one go, she'll die. And if she dies before you extract her blood? Without a living host, the nanocells will just dissipate. Au revoir, nanocells. So either way, she dies. OK. Amy, we're going to have to go for the option where we retain our asset. Natalie, I can't just. I'll get back to you. End calls. What about a transfusion? What should we do, Doctor? Set up for a full blood diagnostic. There has to be a way to get the nanocells out of her safely. A Dr. transfusion? Wakefield, please replace her IV. I can't risk any outside contamination. Sure thing. Dr. Tennant. Get the blood with the nanocells and put blood back in. Simple enough. Need to replace this, okay? Don't bite me. Whoa! <laughs> Shit, sorry. A little rusty. You know what I mean? So bad. Don't. Don't go anywhere. Did he stab himself? Who delivered this crate? Oh, it was here when we arrived this morning. 
Well, it's in the way. It needs to be moved. I don't fucking know, dude. Breeze. Re Dr. Wakefield. Can you move this crate, please? Fucking assistant. Yeah, I'm working, man. You do us a favor. I've still got to deal with this. I'm in the middle of this. Cheers, fella. Chicky chopper. Dr. North. Dr. North. I'm sorry, my shoulder's playing up. Do you mind? It's tennis elbow. He knows. Ah! Oh, my God! Ah! Dr. North? It's not personal. Jeez, what's happening, dude? Pussy bitch. Ah, Stick a ah. knife out, dude. How'd you done today? Talk to North. Talk to North. Talk to me. Oh no, I did not touch him because she, she's infected. <laughs> We're gonna save you, okay? Tattoo on the oak. We'll go next uh, time. Uh, mm. <clears throat> I knew there was something off about Malkin. What kind of a scientist has a fucking ponytail? <sighs> mm -hmm. oh, thank you. You're fine. Oh. Don't take it off. Oh, it's Claire, all right? I'm currently the safest person in this room. Good enough for me. Why are we in lockdown mode? It's detecting the poison from the acid bomb. It won't be in the air for much longer. Thanks for that. Call Natalie Kensington. <phone rings> Emily, where's Natalie? There's been an incident in the lab. Yeah, I can see that, and the biosecurity's kicked in. I need Natalie on the line right now. I don't care who she's with. Yeah, okay, she's in her office. I'll call you right back. And call. Okay. And cool. Okay. First things first, let's get this cleaned up. These games always have the same type of acting. It's like typical. We'll be back in a minute, Claire. Don't go anywhere. It's like in between porn acting and like uh, improv, almost. No mistake, Kip. Well, that needs to come out one way or another. Kensington could have at least left us some of our expensive whiskey. Ah. Uh, this is gonna stink. Ah! What the fuck? Ah! Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh! You loved it. You knows that. Cold. Oh. Mm. Mm. I have to clean this wound. No, 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 it'll be fine. We've got bigger fish to fry. <sighs> Did you hear that? Yeah, what was that? It came from the void. Here, tie this on. I'm gonna go check it out, don't go anywhere. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Welcome to the club, buddy. Good one. Ooh, that outfit is looking hot, dude. Yeah. 
then this in fact who cares dude Dude, as long as you got your tetanus shot, dude, it's whatever, man. Right? What the hell is that? It must be coming from beyond the walls. Is there any security cameras we can check? On the computer, but I don't know how my assistants did that. All right, would you mind? It's a rough metal? No, it's not. It's for any, any man-made metals and things, and also for uh, dirt and whatnot. Because tetanus, right, I think, is in the ground a lot. These are the security cameras in the void. <laughs> Shit on the IRA. The cavalry? In masks? What's the rumbling, though? Sound doesn't travel in a vacuum. Shit, they've deactivated the vacuum. No prizes for guessing who the brains of this operation is. God bless our security walls, eh? They get mini Uzis. This eh? is impossible. They would need unprecedented access to our security systems to be doing this. Dick and Darian, too. I knew you were part of something bigger. Lump us all together because they have the same features. Big eyes and big lips, too. The divisions in my country are complex. Those bunch are not from my team. Mm hmm And now they're fucking with us. Answer call. Amy, what's going on down there? You've been infiltrated, Kensington. Dr. Malkin was a plant. Thanks to him, Dr. North is dead, and so are my dreams of becoming a professional footballer. But you can <laughs> Yeah, as you know that. Emily footballer. Check security footage from the lab. I mean, does privacy even exist around here? There are three mass intruders in the void, and they're armed. They've deactivated the vacuum and bypassed the security wall. I'm still alive. Make sure she knows that. Biosecurity is still enabled, so you are safe no matter what. Well, unless they open the door with that magic laptop. I'll get onto this intruder situation. Oh, well, not that I'm not grateful, but why is lockdown mode still active? The poison from the acid bomb has dissipated and the bioprotector is containing Claire's infection. It must be detecting something else. The safety of London is paramount. We can't risk a bug paramount. getting into the city. Amy, you need to extract Claire's blood, especially if the intruders have come for her. The nanocells cannot fall into the wrong hands. Well, there's uh, an easy way to prevent that. We smoke, Claire. No! End call. Wow. Still can't keep your cool under pressure. She's responsible for this. That makes no sense. We're her only hope That's of retrieving true. the nanocells. Yeah, she's going to let us extract the nanocells and then kill us by gunfire. Wow. Leak much? All right, look, Parker Kaplani designed this lab, right? Do you think he built an escape route, a back door, anything? I don't know. We'd have to ask him ourselves. What now, Claire? Can we move the dead people? What? Now that she mentions it. I mean, she's got big, uh, eye, eye, uh, eye circles. Okay. Like half pipes, dude. How about this one? Enough with the Natalie theories. Remember those new skills I was telling you about? Well, advanced computing is one of them. Programming, coding. Hacking. I prefer the term unsolicited browsing. Yeah, no, sorry. Hacking is better. Look, I know you two are besties, but I find that a bit... Yeah. Let's access her camera. Give it a little listen. This is how scientists get killed, you know. Pog. Yeah, she reminds me a bit of uh, Lana Del Rey. And I love Lana Del Rey. Where did you learn to do this? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. I'm in. Ready? Wait, we shouldn't... Look, if she's got nothing to hide, what's this year? We're in this together. We need to cooperate if we're going to survive. Hacking. <gasps> Go ahead. 
The three intruders in the void have managed to lock every lift and door giving us access down there. Whatever they've done has caused electrical blips throughout the entire building. There are questions. Have the security idiots announced an upgrade gone awry? No one can think this Claire situation's any more serious than it already is. This seems planned, Natalie. There must be more traitors in our midst. Emily, please. Two people are trapped in that lab with our prized asset. They are our priority. Announce the security upgrade. It's not even a British accent, isn't that like Scottish or something? I clear the eyeways in case she calls. Who could the traders be working for? A Scottish. Let's ask the original. That's Irish. Claire. Amy. What do you and your friends want? I'm not an espionage mastermind. They aren't with me. So how did all the nanocells end up inside you? Is it not totally obvious? You should listen to Professor Xavier over there. About what? Kensington. So she put them in you? <laughs> no. <laughs> not me. <laughs> oh no, not again. The convulsions will pass. Your vitals are stable. We'll be fine. Let me know when you're ready to stop speaking in riddles. As Morphe will knock it the fuck out, man. Ready for more cryptic bullshit? She'll be useless. Answer call. Guys, you were right about the intruders. They've sabotaged the system and have electronically barricaded themselves in the void. Yeah. Tell us something we don't know, please. How are they bypassing your security system so easily? Kensington you won't. You definitely won't. Plummets, admit to links off. To... Rescue plans are being made. Well, have you contacted Parker Kaplani? He designed the lab. He'll know how to get us out of here. We've been trying, but he could be anywhere on the planet right now. Parker has no compunctions about who he builds labs for, as long as he pays quote. Excuse me. Emily, wait. Please. Give us something. Help us. Dr. Malkin, the three intruders in the void, Claire, they all infiltrated the complex expertly. What, an another country in the space race, or...? Possibly. Well, they might be trying to steal the nanocells, or destroy them. I'm going to move heaven and earth to try and get hold of Parker. Thank you, Emily. End call. Whatever they're doing up there, we need to come up with some ideas of our own. Is there anything else you can do in the computer system? I can hack, hack the communication lines, get in touch with Parker Kaplan and myself. Okay, awesome. You do that. I'm going to look for a way out of here. <coughs> Are you okay? Downwards trend. What's downwards trend? Yeah, the air is getting The stocks? No, that's impossible. Even in lockdown, love, there's always a steady supply of oxygen. Uh oh. Lost something? Welcome back, Sleeping Beauty. I need something to get me past that vent cover. What? Go fast, man. Break the window. Boom. Okay, well that's not what I meant. I always wished I was taller. Hey mate, do you need a hand? See, even with one leg, Whitefield is still the MVP. Most vanishing person? Ooh. Sorry, that was harsh. No, 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 you've grown some wit. I'm proud. Come on then. Okay. Oh, touched her hand. Sit. 
Uh, be careful. Okay, dude. Okay. So that's good. Yeah, okay, yeah. Can you put this back? Yeah, I got it. Yeah, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay. You going in or not? Okay. Ready? Yeah, up to three. One, two, three. Listen, chat. I've seen enough. Fun. Adult contented to know where this is going. The path will narrow down and then she'll get stuck. Reese, the vent continues behind the oxygen tank. You squeeze past it. Only one way to find out. Go for it, dude. Uh, okay, caution. It's a bomb. It's a trip mine. I knew it. Trip mine. Oh, are you stupid? Made it. That's excellent news. I thought you were going to get stuck. Now he wanted to get stuck, so I told you. I think there's something further on. <sighs> so <Shit>. stupid. Now they both have it in our blood. Wait, 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 wait. Careful. Okay, so they take the time to heal her small oh. finger wound, and cute, this guy has is. an infected I mean, is full leg wound. More impressive. Mine put both of yours to shame. I hate her. <laughs> What's this deal? Where's this troll acting? There's only one wall left between them and the lab door. Please tell me you got a hold of Parker. Negative. Uh, I got hold of the CCTV footage from the past 24 hours. Okay. Sift through it, see if there's anything helpful. Roger that. Fucking sneaky bastard. Claire got access to the lab? Is that your master batch? How did she get that level of clearance on her ID card? Wait, what were you, you injected yourself? Why didn't the lab shut down? The nanocells need time to diffuse in the bloodstream. I was able to get out of the complex before feeling the effects. What the fuck is she doing in the storeroom? I destroyed all the duplicate nanocells too. What? I didn't authorize any duplicates to be made. So you were just stealing the master batch for employers to replicate? Who? Who was it? Was it the Russians? No, I was heading to MI6. To Oh, fucking impeccable timing as always. MI6? Why were you taking them there, Claire? Answer, go! 
Parker. She's in Arnetta, the big one. We got a hold of Parker. Half true. I was already en route. I get alerted every time shit hits the fan in one of my labs. We also have the identities of the three intruders. Sending them through. These guys? They're from last year's batch of Kindarian interns. Sleepers, like Malkin. Yeah, 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 <laughs> guys, guys, guys. There's one security wall between them and us. What have you got? What are our best options, Parker? The sleepers. I need 10 more minutes to study these blueprints. That lab was built to contain world-altering alchemy. So excuse me if back doors won't pardon my thinking. Amy. End call. Reese. What? Do you want to listen to a fucking bullshit about nanocells again? We've got 10 minutes to think without all that shit. Where's B? Where was she hiding it, did? I didn't want to hand this over. It's not meant for you, but fuck it. We need to see the truth about Kensington and Kinder. Her hoo-ha? What does that mean? What is it? Just watch. <laughs> Careful, Amy. Always. I what she's doing. Wait. <laughs> oh! oh. Good one, dude. No, she definitely isn't getting morphine, dude. Jesus. Two files. Kensington and Picnic. <laughs> Which one do you want to watch? Picnic, Panic Basket. Check this little remote, Panic Basket. It still exists! Damn, that meme really died. I'm so sad. If this gets over, we'll be on something to the UN. Kensington Ma. What's the problem? We quashed uprising villages. And you got human trials to assess your technology. To burn one stone. The three whole villages. Your scientists need not know how the data was acquired. The supreme leader is a man of discretion. We trust you are the same. Most certainly. Make sure of it. Or we will. <gasps> um, I think my mind's... I knew it was a big one. Is yours, so do you really want to watch the other video? Go ahead. Please. You sure? Why is she crying? Look, look! You've forgotten the wine but remembered your phone. Typical. <sighs> Nina's mad at me these days. <laughs> well, I'm sorry I forgot the wine, okay? Yeah. Bro, onion bhajis, egg mayo, <laughs> tomatoes. <laughs> Claire takes too many selfies in London. <laughs> Not that much. <laughs> no, look, I'm showing the surroundings. Look, look. Look how pretty this grass is. Come on, let's, let's take a picture. Look at the camera. <laughs> Smile. <laughs> Holy shit, the fuck is that? What's happening? Ah, oh, the human trials. You see... The Kendarian government and Natalie Kensington experimented with the own nanocells on my people. 
my village. Ah, oh, those lips, Jesus. My parents. I lost. My sister Mina. I'm such a comrade. You were killed for opposing the dictatorship. Natalie was making duplicates of the master badge behind my back. My tech killed people. And you were taking all the evidence for my sex. In that USB and in your veins. Now the Supreme Leader has activated a sleeper cell in the complex to cover his tracks. Yeah, not to mention Natalie's. <laughs> Why didn't you tell us this before? They didn't trust you. It's not a Kummer phase. Uh, I've always been this way. Dude, what would I reject the call? Come on now. Reject call. Amy, I need to take a minute and think about this, okay? I'm fine, I promise. Hey, look, I know a rash decision when I see one. Are you not gonna expose Natalie? After what you've just seen? We need to deal with our current predicament. True. Plus, I... I really need the toilet again. Who's spying? Would you believe this isn't the weirdest place I've taken a ship? Do you need me to stay and help you? Ye no, no, you're fine, you're spared. I'll be sitting outside. Thank you, okay. No, he does need help, though. Hey, if we get out of here, will you quit like you said? Pass. I never thought I'd have to answer that question. No, you do the right thing, you always do. A habit I wish I had. Well, I might have rubbed off on you if you'd stuck around. Why'd you leave, Reese? The absurdity. Not knowing whether saving someone was the right thing to do if it condemned them to a life of pain. It's too much for me. Coward isn't the man for you anyway. That wasn't your call to make. We were a team. Hindsight's a bitch, eh? Heard of Mr. Crack in Fortnite in Eritrea. Where can I sign up for this war-torn for world for tour you guys were on? Enough with the wisecracks, Claire. I'm not in the mood. I know how you feel, Amy. You lost people that you love. My feelings are trivial compared to yours. The sense of betrayal, I mean. Come on, give us a break. I meant Natalie. It was a dream come true, getting an internship here. A village girl from Kindar, coming to London to work, to live. Shouldn't he focus on pushing it out, dude? Funny story, <laughs> on my first day here, I was super late because I thought there was a station in the complex. Turns out I was looking at the tourist tube map, the disused and unfinished stations. Yeah, that's right, the um, half-built station under the complex. Tabitha Greens. We're so far underground, we must be right on top of it. Yeah. Yeah, you might be right, Claire. Thank you. Anytime. What did I say? We can't go across the void. We tried going up into the vent, but we haven't tried going down. To Tabitha Green's. You need an access point. We might have one. Reese is sitting on it. What do you have to know? I need something that will remove the, the entire toilet? toilet quickly. Force? How about a bomb? You're gonna have to get your hands dirty. Not necessarily.
Yeah, fucking bomb, man. We're at the lowest point of the complex, so Tabitha Green's must be right below us. I'm not saying yeah, okay. bomb. There's a toilet in the saying bomb. Not for long. Potassium. I'm not saying it right? Amen. My favorite ever chemistry lesson was when the teacher put a small piece of potassium in water. I always wanted to see what a full block would do. <laughs> oh, you are positively insane. <laughs> so now the big question, how far below us is Tabitha Green's? Looks deep. Just throw her first then. Go check it out. No, I I didn't drop Claire! Oh my god, GG! Oh GG! I thought it was Claire for some reason! What? I said the bunny. Everything all right now? Throw in there, throw him. Um. Ponytail, they'd be at the bottom by now. Oh, whoa! Shit. Aye, so it's fine. What was that sun at the end? It was like a pancake or something. Okay, dude. They're going to shoot their way in. Their bullets won't dent these doors. They were built to withstand much more than that. The Void's last resort defense mechanism is the kicker. When it detects a rogue pathogen, it generates a white heat flash to eliminate the threat. This is green screen, dude. <coughs> oh, yeah, he's infected, dude. She's already hardwired into the system. We are fucking fucked. <gasps> Answer, Answer call. call. I think f Guys, the intruders are almost in, and we know why they're here. Parker, what options have we got? Enough! While Parker was accessing the lab security mainframe for bypasses, we saw records of who gained entry in the last 24 hours. Claire entered using someone else's ID credentials. Yours, Amy. That's impossible. I've got my ID card right here. Amy didn't help me. I snuck into her office and I copied her credentials off a computer. You're the liar, Natalie. You don't have a voice here, Claire. Look, we know about Kinder. Reese. We have proof. Lots. Nonsense. Look, the intruders are Natalie and Kinder's way of making sure that we die with their dirty little secret. We know that you hack your own security, Natalie. That's ridiculous. Yeah, your cyber security sucks. Even Reese hacked him easily. Reese has been hacking the system. He isn't an employee here, is he? What's your story, buddy? He spent the last few years bouncing between pharma companies around the world. A mercenary. Who side are you on, Wakefield? You know what? Fuck this. Everyone, calm down. All I know is that if they get in, the nanocells are gone forever. Natalie, please. Look, we aren't traitors. Help us. Stall them. Do something. Amelia, regardless of what we think of each other right now, you're one of my closest friends. Okay, dude. Parker. So we're trusting these guys now? Yes, we are. 
Can the void jam electronics? Negative. Could you reinitialize the vacuum? Two of them aren't wearing helmets. I can't. They've locked us out. Reese could. His computer down there is hardwired into the system. All right. OK, talk me through it All as right. fast as you can. Help, Amy! Help! Help! Tap down. Jesus. What's going on, Claire? Something wrong. <laughs> My heart. <laughs> oh, no, she's going to spit again, dude, like a fucking llama. Aren't you going to wear a mask? No. I trust you. What's that gonna do to help her? <laughs> and this typing did. Oh my god. Did Parker tell you how to turn the vacuum back on? He did. Not so smug now, are you? We're not out of the woods yet. All right, they're still unlocking the door. One down, two to go. Come on. Fuck it, you bastards. Go save him. Door's open, dude. <sighs> Call Natalie Kensington. We're okay. Answer call. Oh, thank God. We saw the lab door didn't open. Good work, Wakefield. Appreciate the guidance, Parker. Thanks for the lead, Natalie. There's still an armed intruder out there. Parker, what else do you have for us? I could go for Natty's internet, unplug the lab, what plug is it this back acting? in. That would kill lockdown what? mode and the vacuum for 60 seconds. You guys can then escape before everything initializes. Emily has a security team poised to handle the last intruder. No, that's a shit plan. He's standing right outside the door. A fucking security team of sprinters wouldn't make it down before he wastes us. He's right, Parker. It's a calculated risk worth taking. OK, well, when could you do this? Whenever you're When you get Claire's blood. Fuck, Natalie. Yes, I know it will kill her, but she's going to die anyway. She'd be sacrificing herself to save millions. Think, Amy. We can't start over again. This has been our lives for the past four years. We're not the only country trying for nanocells. I'm not a murderer. You're a monster, Kensington. Just take the blood, Amy. Man. Time is running out. Deal or no deal? I don't deal with terrorists. End call. I don't negotiate with terrorists, man. Fuck her. We're trapped in a corner here, Amy.
There has to be another way that doesn't involve killing Claire. There isn't. We're trapped. Yeah, by Natalie. The lab's in lockdown mode because she ordered it. There's no other chemical threat outside of Claire's bioprotector. Yeah, there is. Actually. How? I should have brushed up on my needle handling. Look, this is a Mexican standoff we're going to lose. It won't be long until I'm like Claire, and eventually the oxygen will run out. So Parker's crazy plan of opening that door is our only hope. <laughs> You've changed your tune. Maybe Natalie will rescue us. Yeah, you want to bet? All the evidence of her actions in Kindar is down here. The nanocells are our only leverage. Take her blood, however much you need. Claire, give me your arm, please. I thought you were different. Shut up. Your arm. Tell me honestly. Can you save me? No. There's almost no chance of it. Your internal physiology is completely changed, and I can't predict what's going to happen. You're weak. Look, I don't even know if I'm going to survive this. But if I do, I promise... Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop. I've got enough. What the fuck are you talking about? Don't stick it in. <laughs> That's what she said. Reese. <laughs> Come on, Luden. Claire can live to Claire can live to fight another day. <sighs> it's about time I contributed an escape plan. Luden. While Parker was talking me through the vacuum reset, I realised that a full lab reset wouldn't be much different. We don't need those pricks upstairs. But if you reset the lab, they'll be alerted. That's where things get creative. I hacked into the lab security camera and recorded the last three minutes of you preparing to extract Claire's blood. I can output that three minutes of footage onto their security feed. While you escape, they'll think you're following orders. This guy hacks, then. How did you come up with this? Huh? Sorry to move it. <laughs> OK, but. What about our last remaining obstacle outside? I said I'm mission and impossible. And why are you speaking in the second person? I'm going to take him out. I'm infected. As soon as I step into the void, that heat flash will trigger. Maurice, you've lost it. If I die in here, lockdown mode ends and he gets in. If I die out there, so does he. And you, you have a chance. And the ultimate simple weak, last weak. mover. It's time to become an asset. Just take Claire, run. Sure, man. And save her. Mm -hmm. Please. Come on, let's no, 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 no. I chose this, OK? And that's how you make a life. Every single choice along the way counts. I fucking hate you. Don't kiss. Yikes. You know, I went back to that beach. And Kindar. To face it. That woman was there. Dima. She's just playing with a little girl. She called her Amy. <laughs> I'm sorry for leaving you. No kissy.
you get back. Yeah, didn't your mother ever tell you not to kiss anyone carrying a life-threatening pathogen? <laughs> I appreciate the sentiment, though. More than you know. Jesus. Chat, when you brush your teeth or whatever, in your mouth there forms micro lesions. Wait! And you can sort of transmit stuff with that, man. There? Switch places with me, Reese. I think? Or am I wrong? At this stage. You have a far better chance of surviving than I do. Come on. You have all the evidence against Kensington. Make sure the world sees it. No, Claire, I'll do it. Drop it. The bioprotector will stop the lab detecting your infection. And you two can escape. Ah, Claire's Come a bitch on. ass, dude. She's going under, dude. She's already transforming. Promise. We'll expose Natalie and we'll share your story with the world. Thank you. I can't read the fuck out of this thing. <sighs> oh. Did you do that, Parker? 25 you kills. Know. I'm sitting here. Hey, Claire. Thank you. I got a couple times. Chemical threat detected. The Deep green screen. Green screens was getting blurry. Security lab alpha system reset complete. Nailed it, Claire. That usually means that there isn't enough lighting in the room. Oh, looks good to me. Yeah. She's going to get the nano cells. Well done, Amy. I wouldn't have. What was that? Nothing. Three minutes. Oh? No, Amy, fuck that! Get a machine gun! A little Uzi. <laughs> right, careful. Okay, ready? Mm hmm. Two of them had one, right? Ah. Akimbo. Oh. We have to change out of our lab suits. They'll draw too much attention. How bad is it? Can you see the bone? That bone. I'm gonna go to the disabled toilet and grab the folder. That's fat. Okay, change quick. Yes, ma'am. <sighs> it must look like a right side. <laughs> it's not bone, dude. I wasn't bluffing about the security team. OK, 
Okay, there's an exit out of the back of the building. It'll be way less guarded. Right, so what are we waiting for? Nally's office is down there. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Yeah, let's. Oh no. Let's finish what Claire started. Oh, my six, here we come. Stop right there, Amy Tennant. I guess three minutes wasn't long enough. We know Wakefield has nanocells in his system. Hand him over and this can end without bloodshed. Yikes. Well, that's clearly bullshit. Just Should do him. it, Amy. What if I shoot him right now? Then the nanocells are gone forever. Steady. We need Reese alive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Reese wants to um, stay alive too. Amy? This is a mistake, Amy. Why doesn't she hide behind him? Nothing, man. Oh, come on, Amy. You're not really going to do this over a few Kandarians. <laughs> no! I'm so sorry, Reese. No! Fire! What do you mean? Well, I don't know what the fuck I was supposed to do there, dude. I did. I'm not supposed to decrypt the message that it says in a half a second. What does that mean? For Emmy, for Amy, for whatever, for Claire. Like, dude, fuck, man. Whatever, man. Let me increase the light. Low fans. What was I supposed to do, man? I don't know what to do. I want to click for the greater good. Fuck, man. The greater good would have been the same.